something, honestly, that I get super excited about because we hardly ever have anything in this category and we've never had anything like this before. So when I was growing up, I remember the first time my parents took me to a planetarium. I love, no, I took your story. <laughs> I, I love, we went to, um, and then when I moved to New York City when I was 19, I went to the Hayden Planetarium. It was one of my favorite things to do. I was a student in an acting school at the time and you got like a discount card and you could go to museums uh, for free. Also, also bars and nightclubs they would give actresses. <laughs> That's another thing that they would give you if you were an actress in New York City in the 80s. But anyway, um, I digress. So. I loved the idea of what's out there, what's in the cosmos. Um, there's a very famous guy that I follow on Instagram that talks about, you know, the stars, and I just, it's just so fascinating. But this is the first time you, with your cell phone, can take a picture of a constellation. So I'm a Gemini. <laughs> I'm a Gemini, my birthday is like in a month. Um, so you look into the stars, you see that constellation. Maybe you're somebody who's an expert, you can eyeball it and know what the constellation is. You don't need to be. You will have the ability to identify them, and that's the technology of this, from National Geographic, which is a company that has really brought us closer to what we called in junior high, Earth Science. Yeah. Do you remember Earth Science? Aaron Berger's our special guest, and I'm just joking. He doesn't call me nearly enough. I was, <laughs> I was hoping he would call me every day to come hang out. I would just laugh <laughs> he just, all the time he, if I did. He's like, new phone, who did? So, yeah. <laughs> that's basically what, what I get. Oh, Helen, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so here's the deal. Uh, we we, as you said, uh, don't offer a lot of telescopes. So it's, it's so much fun for Helen and I to come out here. I didn't know you knew so much about, you know, just kind of amateur. Uh... Uh, I've never had anything like this, but it's like, I don't have the same cell phone I had a decade ago. Right. You don't want the same telescope no, you had a, a decade ago. That's a great point. But what you do want is one from National Geographic, yes. right? A name that is both incredibly contemporary. They have, I think 2.8 million, I think is the last I checked on their Instagram followers, like incredibly contemporary and also really nostalgic. I remember right. growing up watching National Geographic specials with my folks on Sunday night. It's, it's a name we know for education. And it's nice for me as a guy who sells electronics, so always something with a screen to come out here and go, hey, there, here's something you can do by yourself or with your kids that's really fun and it's, you don't plug it in, you know? So that's, yeah. that's really nice. Let me sort of right. walk you through it. You don't think of that. Do you know? You know, you're right. You yeah. don't plug it in. You, you don't. You don't plug this in. Now, it really is amazing. There is a cool thing you'll see in a minute because there is an app that sort of changes everything. But still, telescopes have been around for thousands of years, right? Let's learn a little bit about this one. So here's the first thing. It is the size of the telescope. So this is a 70 millimeter, that's the aperture, what's called refractor telescope. So this doesn't invert images like a reflector telescope does. And the size of that aperture is uh, what lets the light in. So letting the light in means you're able to see more of the um, deep sky or the near sky, the, what they call the Messier objects in the sky. So Saturn and Pluto and the moon and, and all of those sorts of things, even um, at times that maybe another telescope with a smaller aperture mm -hmm. wouldn't be able to see that because it wouldn't be able to gather all the light. Okay, so that's number one. Then we have here, this is the focal length, what they call the focal length, it's carbon wrapped, the tube on the telescope. And then this is really important. You get a couple of lenses. So these are what are called plossal lenses. For anyone who knows anything about telescopes, these are some of the best lenses money can buy. By the way, <laughs> side note, last time I had this, I've had this telescope on air only one other time, it was $99. So it's nice to see it at this kind of price going into. Our price is going down everywhere, Aaron. <laughs> yeah, like literally <laughs> it's, no. I feel like nationally prices are just dropping <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> the first time I'm like, oh, this is $20 more, this is $20 more, this yeah. isn't. So um, This and, is the kind of item that you definitely want to get right now. Yeah. Because we got these secure a while ago. Because you know we always it's done. do. We, right, we do everything everything way ahead. That's why this price is so extraordinarily low. And the fact that they took $10 off, they didn't need to do that. Right. Absolutely. They did not need to do that. That's a, a great point. Another thing you'll notice, this has what's called um, an elbow eyepiece on it. And what's nice about this is you can just comfortably look into it instead of the other option would be this, right? Down on your knees, staring all night. Right. Um, and if you're a kid, it's the perfect height. Right. right. Well, <laughs> that, I'm glad you said that too. Yeah. This is a full size aluminum stand. Often we say, oh, you know, and for an additional 30 or $40, right. you can get a full size aluminum. We include it all. It is so easy to set up 
Anyone can do this. I'm gonna show you one more thing and then I'm gonna knock your socks off. So this is the 26 millimeter Plasso lens. It has um, about a 26 times zoom on it. This is the 9.7 millimeter. It has a 72 times zoom on it. And then, then, we also have what's called a Barlow lens that will double both of those. So in effect, it's like getting four different zoom lengths, okay? That's amazing. But here's my favorite part. In the, like I said, I haven't sold a million telescopes, like I've sold a million computers and a million tablets. I feel like but presented I've, maybe three in 17 years. I was gonna say, but I've, I've sold a couple Ma dozen, yeah. and the feature I'm about to show you now is what people go, it's the reason this customer pick after customer pick after customer pick. There's a place, yeah, you guys, you guys know exactly where I'm going, on the top of your phone, where you can put a smartphone which is what I've done here. And it's called the, it's the um, Star Seeker app that you download, it's free. There's a, a little QR code. In fact, I'm gonna grab the um, directions here for just a second and show you. These directions are super clear. There's a QR code right there. So you point your device at the QR code and you download this. And here's what it means. And it's free. Oh yeah, free, absolutely, 100% free. 100 okay. free. This, is, this changes everything. Because like I said, I'm an amateur. I mean, Helen stole my story about going to the planetarium. <laughs> I had no idea you were going to tell that story. Oh, uh, it's like my favorite, because I'll never forget. You can tell it. I'll never forget it. The first time I went to a planetarium as a kid. We had different families. It was is, a different... <laughs> <laughs> Did we? Did we? Were we? I, I, my parents told me I was adopted <laughs> last week, so I was we wondering. We look alike? Yeah, okay. Anyway, I'll never forget as a kid, my folks taking me to the planetarium for the first time. I, I don't know why, it was just Oh, it was a huge, magical, it was the wonder of the universe. Right? When magical. you're a little kid, it, change, it changes your, your life. This does too. So this is kind of like having a planetarium at home because when you move this, you start to see what you're um, telescoping. So what you're finding. So I'll find a, maybe a constellation there. Okay, there we go. And you guys are seeing oh, that perfect full screen. Thank you all. So we're. We're looking at the uh, uh, Corona Borealis. It's something thought of as a crown from Greek mythology, uh, which Dionysus gave to Ariande, daughter of Minos of Crete. The Cayenne tribe of Native Americans uh, used to build their camps in a semicircle, so they called it the camp circle. And in Welsh mythology, it was referred to as the castle of the silver circle. Who would have ever known, right? Like I in a million that. years. And then this is cool too. Now you're just gonna see the set when I do this, but it's okay. If if we were looking actually at the night sky, right. we're, we're inside, but this geolocates where you are, connects via Bluetooth, so it knows what it's seeing, even mm -hmm. when it's inside. You can go to basically a camera view or a clear view. So that's what it's actually seeing. And then you could take a picture. Now in a minute, I'll show you how you can take a magnified so picture as well. So you can take a magnified yeah. picture of the night sky, second. maybe pointing towards um, the constellation that is your astrological sign. There you go. You see all the big words I used in that sentence? What are you, did you say you're a Gemini? <laughs> yeah, I'm a Gemini. Yeah, I'm dating a Virgo, would you? I don't know anything about <laughs> it. I'll, I'll, I'll text you, I'll tell you okay. what to do. Yeah, you're in trouble. <laughs> It's not, you're good. Watching. it's not good though. Okay, go. <laughs> no, no, I'm kidding. It's all good. It's all good. By the way, the price is going to go back up to $150. We're doing a sale for this, but let me just mention that HSN coupon. This is a coincidence that this happens to be on a day. I didn't know when I came here today to come to work that it was going to be $40. When I worked on Friday, it was $15. So $40 is one of the biggest coupons we've done. We usually do it like oh, Black good. Friday. You know, you're here a lot during right before the holidays. Yeah. We do a lot of electronic specials. So $40 off your order, you can take it off of the telescope. So it would be $49.99 for the telescope, all the lenses, plus the tripod. Um, you get all of that. And, and so no annual fee for the HSN card. And you could get one by going to our website, hsn.com, and just put HSN card in the search. So I do always talk a lot about the credit card offer when we have a huge coupon. And today happens to be the day. But you know, I love this video, Aaron, because it's no one's, you know, your cell phone's involved, but no one is like glued to it. You're having no. a conversation, you're talking. That's what I remember about these outings when I was a kid. You know, my parents are college professors, so there always smart. was like a, <laughs> <laughs> educational something or other, yeah. you know, but I wasn't the, I was just thinking, I remember the p planetarium and that first, yeah. like the expanse of the universe. This is something amazing. And I, I've never like thought that with my cell phone that I could take the picture of what I'm looking. Maybe you, maybe you see a shooting star. 
Uh, my husband follows this uh, site that gets like, oh, it's a meteor shower tonight. Yeah, 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 if, yeah, you, yeah. if you go there, you can go there with your telescope, point it up there, picture the meteor shower, put it on social we media. We have one coming up in a, in a couple of months. Actually, I right. think it's June, and then I think on August right. the 14th, there's four or five planets that also, align as well. Also, we have like a pink moon the the, the it was did you it see was it like I three nights ago two three nights it, ago it was like two three nights was, ago that's how i was gonna my husband gives me the alerts on all the celestial oh he's so into that yeah oh i love it so you can the idea that you could take a picture of it I, now i'm thinking i need to get this for him squirrel it away for the holidays why not if if i if he wasn't like staring out the window like that lady the neighbor <laughs> lady from bewitched every day i can't get anything past him <laughs> what was her name not aunt tabitha i <laughs> no, love no, aunt tabitha no, the, the neighbor oh, who no, wasn't neighbor. a witch who would watch Ooh, all the neighborhood goings on. I'm going to work on that. Oh, I know. Yeah, I can't it's remember. not Mrs. Roper. That's Tell the wrong Tell me on my Facebook too. page what that name is. <laughs> but you get the tripod, you get the mount, you get all the lenses, and you get the telescope for $89.99 and free shipping. Free shipping. I'll tell you, we had a lot of, I just had some furniture in the last hour that yeah. have reduced shipping. Yeah. This is probably weighs more and is more expensive to ship. It's a big box. If you mm. have no somebody's birthday coming up, Father's Day. What a great Father's Day present. Oh, great Father's Day present. Amazing Father's Day present. Amazing Father's Day present. This is something you can, so you can do with that as an adult, you mm -hmm. know, which is kind of neat. It's nice to have conversations around. One thing I will show you real quickly, this is another piece that adds to it where you can take your phone, put your phone right on the top, and it goes boom. And that's how you take the, that's how you take the zoomed picture. Oh. Now, Here's what I want to show you. We have zoomed pictures that we took with this telescope. So oh, you are seeing, crazy. you are seeing right now the moon, obviously the moon. A and that great was taken with a cell phone. Picture of a full, that was taken with a cell phone with this telescope. Okay, all right, so there's the moon. Let's, we got, we have, so the Hubble uh, telescope was not involved. You know, no, not at okay, all. Okay, just double checking. And then you can see a, not about a three quarters moon. Then you can see, and notice like you can see the craters. You can see the details of the moon. You can see landmarks on the moon with this. Uh, I wanna show you, we've got some wild, okay. This is Jupiter. This is my second favorite picture of Jupiter. I think it's amazing, but can you believe we took this I with this $89 incredible. telescope and with the cell phone that's in my back pocket? So that's Jupiter. Check out this next one. That's Jupiter and its moons. You can even see you them even on a see, good, like, clear night. You can, you can see the orbit, where they are, the position. That's really amazing. And then my entirely favorite one uh, that I took, period, you know what that is? Saturn? Yeah. You got the With rings the ring and of everything Saturn on a from good, Earth, clear from your cell phone. From this, from an $89 telescope. Look, it's from National Geographic. It's a brand we know. It's a brand we trust. It's a brand uh, we know will make things simple for us. And that's one of the key things. You're yeah, this is simple, right? Oh. This isn't like, okay, 15 getting, minutes set up. 15 minutes uh, set up. Hand on heart. Hand on heart. You can take it anywhere. You, it, it, you can Did travel Adam with teach it you easily. That? No, does, he, does he say that? He says it all the time. Well, we have worked together for 20 years, so I imagine we... You're, you're like twinning right now. You don't know where it starts. You don't I'm know like, where he ends and you begin. Right, then, Mike, here we go. You know, we have the same He's birthday. He's the only person I've, I do, We really? literally have the same, yeah, five so years apart, So you and him should birthday. look at the stars together at the same <laughs> constellation, because you have the same... Right, then, here we go. There you go. That Not is that the worst good. English accent. I know, it's terrible. absolutely terrible. It's like my fair you're lady. like, hello, governor. <laughs> like, what are we I'm doing? I'm getting married in the morning. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> You get the idea. We're getting off track, so. as I always do. But here we go. We've got a huge sale price. We've got a product that is really specialized. And let's be honest, the, the parts, like all the, you know, the le the most expensive thing on here, honestly, the glass for the lenses. Got the Plasso that, lenses. You think about a camera professional photographer, those lenses, the glass, you're getting those lenses. So the, the idea that the prices of those in the future, who knows, up, down, everything. It's like yo-yoing everywhere. We are doing a sale price. This is so extraordinary. $22 and change and free shipping and handling. You're getting everything. Uh, the telescope, the tripod, the mount, um, and all the instructions, including the QR code that makes all this so easy and use the cell phone you already have to take those pictures. Gosh, you know, we talk about, oh, I want to make my social media more interesting. How interesting would your social media be with this? You know, they it's say like, oh, it's my best friend's birthday. Here's the stars that show that. You yeah. know, something, you know, everything would be amazing. One other so sort of little point, but as I said, this is a refractor telescope. So one of the cool things about that is it doesn't invert images, which means if you're looking at images on Earth, so if you're like, you know, birding or something like that, oh, yeah. 
Yeah. You can with a checking off the the you gotta check off everything. That's right. Yeah. You, you can, gotta and it doesn't invert the, the images. Oh, so okay. not just for um, sky objects, right. but for Earth objects that are right. far away as well. Especially uh, using that, uh, we recommend first using the 26 millimeter, which is about a 26 time um, zoom lens because that gives you a nice wide viewing field, and then you can kind of drill down from but there. But I think anything far away looks closer up because we're using the example of the planets. <laughs> Isn't that a so great if you could point. take a picture of the planet, you could take a picture <laughs> of, of the other Osprey. things. But yeah, <laughs> right? I mean, yeah. it's really, really, look at that. That is absolutely incredible. Yeah, and you Saturn. know, when I was growing up in the 70s, like if somebody said, there's a picture, it would have had to been at a million, multi-million dollar university funded, tel you know, planetarium and that kind of, I mean, it's just mind boggling what, the, what we, what just a regular person can do now. The University of Louisville, I grew up in Louisville, Kentucky, is the first planetarium where I ever went. And, and like we both said, you know, kind of started, we remember those experiences as kids mm -hmm. so well, they're kind of seared in our core right. memories. Yes. Because they're so special. These are special memories that you can create with your family really, really easily. Oh, do you see? What? Glad of Kravitz. Oh. Oh, it's nosy neighbor Gladys Kravitz. <laughs> Thank you so much, Trivia. That's awesome. The trivia Gladys That's what Kravitz. I was talking yep. about. You too could be the Gladys Kravitz <laughs> in your neighborhood with this telescope, actually. You can get the license plates of the, the boyfriend of the someone 12, 12 feet away, 12 doors down. Uh, now, Aaron's coming back later on at the end of the show with a laptop that I grabbed to have out here. And here's the amazing part is that it is, let me just show this, a touchscreen. So it is a touchscreen laptop.